play with Yiffy Yi on pole position once again. And he would lead us down towards turn number one. Nicholas Gruton on the inside of the front row didn't get a good launch. From seventh place, we were all waiting for Lucas Dunner to make places. And he would do so immediately on board of him to the very right of screen. He would go from seventh to third in one fell swoop. Fantastic move from him. He would make uh, contact with Sebastian Esner in the process. He would have to come into the pit. That was Rui Andrade going off at Lesmo 2. And then the fighting continued with Lucas Dunner fighting away with Cameron Daz here for second place. That allowed Yifuyi to get a bit of a gap and we would never see him again. There were fantastic moves from everyone in this battle. That was Cameron Daz doing one of them round the outside at the second chicane. But he wouldn't be able to get rid of Lucas Dunner in the process. He would come back at him once again into the first chicane. And sitting in behind Nicholas Cruton, who was quiet for a while but would then make his progress here. That was Manuel Maldonado going with a brilliant block pass on Cameron Daz. This was unfortunately the moment we saw the yellow flags out at Ascari. Ido Cohen tagging the back of Bardignon, who would be bitched into the gravel and stay there to the end. But out front, it would be Yiffy Yi, who would win by just under two seconds ahead of his teammate Lucas Dunner and Nicholas Cruton rounding out the top three.